Welcome everyone to another video. Last month I've done a tutorial how to increase and decrease your post data. But now I decided to do a test um, after submitting your ATX. This was actually successful, but there was a few problems. Should you do it? Let's find out. <laughs> So my steps was, um, because I already created proof, I had to delete the post bin file. Of course, this is my proof because I'm going to have to create a new proof for the new space. I also deleted the new post files, but as it turns out, this was not necessary. And uh, I will explain this later. I had to take a few screenshots as I go along. So on this part, I sh you can see that uh, I started the new post size. So the monitor shows uh, halfway down. I did target for two tips, but this changed um, later on. Also, as you can see in the monitor rewards, I was waiting for two layers rewards to which I actually got paid while I was increasing the post size. So after I finish my post you have to go through two poets which I did and as you can see now I'm eligible for Epoch 11. Why deleting the new post wasn't important? Uh, this was because as soon as I finish proof and uh, turn on the node and connect to the poet, both NIP posts reappeared on the disk drive straight away. There was nothing, there was no read now, nothing. The node connected and received the NIP post. This is because it was recognized by other nodes and they just sent me the NIP post files. So now we are on Epoch 11 and uh, I had to decrease my post size because I didn't have uh, enough space and I was having problems with um, finishing the poet but um, you can see uh, I was eligible for one reward after the new post size and this is where it gets tricky because I was supposed to get two layers as reward but I did it this is the reason why as you can see my smasher ID uh, it's there okay and um, I did get my layer reward expect rewards I did get paid for that but look at my size that's the old size as you can see I have 28 there and I only recorded 15. Why is that? Well, let me explain. So according to NJ, the network or the protocol actually supports the new size. As you can see, I wasn't banned. But the nodes, they don't. So even though I have the new size and send the new size, the nodes don't know what to do with it. So they noticed, okay, it's the same node ID with the same ATX, but the size does not match. So let's just use the old size. And that's what they've done because they don't know how to act with the new size. So yeah, I got stuck with this. So maybe in the future, they will change the protocol and uh, I'll keep the, this size for now. NJ also said that um, I'm going to be equivocated. Well, so far I wasn't, but he also said I might need to wait another epoch um, to see. Uh, well, I'm not going to delete the new size anyway, so I'm just going to wait. And uh, if things change, then uh, I'll keep you guys updated. So to the question, can I increase post after publish the ATX? The simple answer is to do it. I've done it. So far the node is working. I don't know what's going to be on the next epoch. I'll find out next Friday. 
but uh, at the moment because the nodes do not support this don't do it don't waste time just create a new node and be done with it i hope this answers the question and thank you for watching don't forget to subscribe and put a like on the video until next time